in this tutorial I just want to show you how you can add page numbers to your worksheet in Excel so that way whenever you go to print it you can have a page number at the top or at the bottom wherever you want so that way we, um, you can just have the page numbers and it will look nice so to do this first step go right down here to the bottom to change the view um, personally I would pick the page layout view and okay so after clicking that, as you can see, it goes from being a normal worksheet to now it's, it's um in pages, right? So then to add a a page number, you can do this in either the header right up here, or as you scroll down, we can see there's a footer at the bottom. As you can see right here, there's a footer at the bottom, right? So then to add a page number, all I have to do is click in the header or the footer. So just say you do the header, for example, and then click at the top, header and footer. And then under um, header and footer elements, we can just do page number. And we can even do number of pages as well, too. So just say page. And add the page number. Then you see you have one at the top. If you scroll down, you have a two. And there's a three. And now, if we go back to normal to the normal view, and we go to print it, as you can see, there's a page number at the top of your page. One last note is that um, if you are going to print, and for some reason you don't see all your pages printing, one thing you can do is you can actually manually adjust the pages that are um, seen. So instead, so it's going from Instead of page layout, go to page break preview, and you can like manually drag these blue bars to adjust the pages um, that you are working with in like the page lines. So that's it. I hope you found this tutorial to be helpful, and I hope you will use this to take your Excel worksheets up to the next level. Like, subscribe, comment. Every subscriber is closer to a thousand. So thank you so much for your support. Um, you'll have a great day.